Think about it. Nearly everything we use today draws inspiration from the genius of nature. You'll find products like adhesive bandages, airplanes, and even iconic structures like the Eiffel Tower. All of them taking cues from organic forms, patterns, and systems in the natural world. Hey there, welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving deep into the fascinating world of biomimicry, where we take a closer look at how Mother Nature herself can inspire us to create sustainable and innovative solutions for a better world. Did you know, for instance, that Velcro, those handy hook and loop fasteners, were inspired by Swiss engineer George de Mestral's observations of burdock burrs sticking to his clothes and his dog's fur during a walk? And speaking of innovation, Japan's Shinkansen bullet trains underwent a transformative redesign, all thanks to the Kingfisher's beak shape, which reduces noise, increases aerodynamics, and results in faster, more energy-efficient trains. These are just a few examples of how biomimicry leads to practical and elegant solutions that improve the way we live and interact with our environment. Biomimicry is not just about borrowing ideas from nature. It's a well-defined philosophy guided by three core principles. First up, we have emulate. This principle encourages designers to observe and understand nature's strategies, forms, and processes, and then apply that knowledge to create innovative human-made solutions. Nature has gone through millions of years of trial and error, refining its designs for efficiency and resilience. By mimicking these natural models, Designers can harness the power of evolution and adapt nature's solutions to human needs and challenges. Next, we have ethos. This principle embodies the ethical responsibility of designers to prioritize sustainability, regenerative practices, and the well-being of humans and the natural world. Instead of focusing solely on short-term gains, biomimicry encourages designers to consider the long-term impacts of their creations on the environment, society, and future generations. Lastly, Reconnect emphasizes the importance of fostering a deeper connection with nature. In today's rapidly urbanizing and technology-driven world, many of us have become disconnected from the natural world, leading to a lack of understanding and appreciation for the intricate relationships that sustain life on Earth. Biomimicry inspires designers to actively engage with nature, learn from its processes and systems, and develop a sense of awe and respect for the natural world. When it comes to putting biomimicry into practice, there are two main approaches, problem-based and solution-based. In the problem-based approach, we start by identifying a specific environmental or technological challenge that needs solving. It could be related to sustainability, resource efficiency, pollution reduction, or any other issue. Once we've defined the problem, biomimicry designers or researchers turn to nature to study various organisms, ecosystems, and processes that have already evolved effective strategies to tackle the identified challenge. On the other hand, the solution-based approach starts by observing and understanding existing natural adaptations and designs Rather than targeting a specific problem at the outset, designers explore the vast array of biological organisms and ecosystems to discover inspiring and elegant solutions that have already evolved in nature. So, let's talk examples, and there are plenty of them. Biomimicry has already led to incredible innovations in various fields. In architecture, termite mounds have inspired the creation of buildings that mimic the thermoregulatory properties of these incredible structures, resulting in significant energy savings. Transportation researchers have taken cues from birds and fish to create more aerodynamic vehicles and aircraft, which help mitigate excessive fuel consumption and emissions. Even in the realm of renewable energy, nature's photosynthesis has influenced the development of more efficient solar panels. Did you know that the design of wind turbine blades was inspired by humpback whales? These majestic creatures have unique tubercles on the edge of their flippers, reducing drag and increasing lift. Now, let's dive into the critical concepts of biomimetic design. Nature has produced a plethora of remarkable materials with exceptional properties, like the strength and flexibility of spider silk, 
By incorporating these nature-inspired materials, designers can create sustainable products that reduce our environmental footprint. If you're enjoying this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more interesting episodes. Nature's systems are inherently energy efficient and resource conserving. Understanding these ecological processes enables designers to develop solutions that optimize energy use and resource management. From energy efficient buildings to water saving systems, biomimicry offers innovative ways to conserve resources. Biological systems are renowned for adapting and thriving in changing environments. Designers can learn from nature's resilience and integrate adaptability into sustainable designs, ensuring that creations can withstand and respond to evolving environmental conditions. However, while biomimicry holds immense promise, it also presents some challenges. Not all natural designs can be directly translated into human applications due to differences in scale, material properties, and environmental constraints. Some adaptations from nature may not fit well within our current technological context, requiring further research and development. The future of biomimicry is bright. As technology advances, we'll continue to delve deeper into nature's blueprints, unlocking even more sustainable solutions. Biomimicry is poised to revolutionize various industries, from architecture and transportation to energy and beyond. Embracing nature-inspired solutions will compel businesses and individuals to proactively contribute to a cleaner, greener planet. Now, let's delve into a real-world biomimicry success story, a tangible example that showcases the sheer potential of nature-inspired innovation. The Shinkansen E7 series, a remarkable high-speed train in Japan, stands as a real-world biomimicry success story showcasing the incredible potential of nature-inspired innovation. In this case study, we'll explore how the streamlined design of the Kingfisher bird inspired this iconic train, revolutionizing the world of transportation. Japan is renowned for its advanced rail technology known as the Shinkansen, or bullet train. Engineers look to the natural world for inspiration when designing the E7 series. The E7 series designers drew inspiration from the Kingfisher bird's beak, which effortlessly enters the water with minimal splash. The train's front was reshaped to mimic the Kingfisher's beak, reducing aerodynamic drag and noise during high-speed travel. Engineers studied the Kingfisher's ability to swiftly dive into the water, translating this efficiency into the train's enhanced performance. The E7 series also incorporates lightweight and durable materials, reducing energy consumption. The streamlined design reduced air resistance, enabling the E7 series to reach up to 260 km per hour, 162 miles per hour. The Kingfisher-inspired nose significantly reduced noise levels, leading to a quieter and more comfortable ride. Lower aerodynamic drag reduced energy consumption and environmental impact. Reduced noise and vibration enhanced the overall passenger experience. The biomimetic design contributed to a reduction in energy consumption, making high-speed rail travel more sustainable. By optimizing aerodynamics, the E7 series emitted fewer pollutants per passenger kilometer compared to traditional trains or cars. The train's quieter operation reduced noise pollution in urban and rural areas. The E7 series became a symbol of Japanese engineering excellence, enhancing the country's reputation in high-speed rail technology. Japan's expertise in biomimetic design and rail technology led to international sales and collaborations. Improved train services and comfort attracted more passengers, boosting tourism in regions served by the E7 series. The Shinkansen E7 series, inspired by the Kingfisher Bird's streamlined design, is a shining example of how nature-inspired biomimicry can revolutionize transportation. Its impact extends beyond Japan's borders, influencing rail technology worldwide. This case study underscores the potential for innovative design solutions when engineers and designers draw inspiration from the natural world. By replicating the efficiency and elegance of the Kingfisher Bird, the E7 series exemplifies how biomimicry 
can lead to more sustainable and advanced transportation systems, benefiting both passengers and the environment. It serves as a testament to the power of nature-inspired innovation in shaping the future of transportation. So, to wrap it all up, biomimicry is all about tapping into nature's wisdom to create a more sustainable future. It's about learning from millions of years of evolution to address the pressing challenges of our time. And as we embrace nature-inspired solutions, we're moving towards a cleaner, greener planet. That's it for today's video on biomimicry. Don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, and ring the notification bell for more exciting content like this. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next video. Peace.